The truth about full-time real estate investor. I have not had a job in over 10 years. September of 2012 is when I got fired from my last job, you know? And I'm telling you guys that it's not everything you see on social media, but some of these guys who are caught up um, with the scamming that's going on on social media, I can look at their social media and tell you they don't do real estate if they portray to that they, that they can ride around a Lamborghini all day, that they can walk around in suits when they're doing residential real estate um, in discounted homes. You're buying stuff like this. But listen, when you first get started out as a full-time real estate investor, you're probably not gonna have a team. It's probably going to be yourself. There's no set schedule. This is entrepreneurship, guys. There's no set schedule, right? And being that there's no set schedule, meaning you're probably gonna be calling sellers back, cold calling, you're gonna be texting, you're gonna be going on appointments, right? You're gonna be going on appointments and you're gonna be busy. You're gonna be going on those appointments, you're gonna ride past a house, and that seller may be interested in selling, but the one that you, you went to go see, they're not interested at your price point. You're gonna be running all around the city and on the outskirts, right? It's gonna be a lot of work. And this is not a nine to five, you know. I don't shut my phone off at five. If a seller wants to meet me or somebody from my team at seven, eight at night, we were going to make it happen. Whether we're emailing that contract out, whether we are uh, going out there to meet them, we are going to get that done. And the reason being is because the money never sleeps. If we, we have to get that seller's issue resolved right then and there or they can go to somebody else and that person makes fifteen thousand dollars off the deal and that fifteen thousand dollars could have been in your pocket real estate investing you're going to be extremely busy starting out you're not going to have time to hang out the family and friends driving the lamborghini etc you probably won't even be able to afford the lamborghini however as you start making a hundred thousand two hundred thousand three hundred thousand dollars a year you can start hiring out, right? As you start doing $40,000 deals, $50,000 deals, you can start hiring components out and that's when you start to take your time back. The real estate is not exactly the vehicle that's gonna give you your time because believe me guys, I've been full-time since and this guy is still running one-man bands. It's guys that started when I started and all they're doing is wholesaling. And it's some guys that they were full-time, they had to go back and get a job because they just couldn't sustain. However, I'm telling you, you could avoid those things if you get to a point where you got thirty to $50,000 put up in your account, you got more deals closing, then you can start hiring a team. See, the freedom actually comes with high, putting in the right people in the right places. With me, I, I never want to be one of those old time landlords, guys that I buy their house probably after 30, 40 years after they're done with them and they're ready to just, you know, dump, they're ready to move on with their life. I never want to be the guy who has, I'm fixing toilets, right? I never want to be the guy who I'm at the house and I got to babysit all the contractors. No, I got property management for my rentals, guys. Property management handles all that. Something goes wrong, call property manager. I don't want to be that guy. I, you know, some people, they will try to save themselves a dollar, but cost themselves $10 and their peace. I'm not willing to do that, guys. I got a system set up for that. Also, my wholesaling business. I got employees, I got people who work for me, I got virtual assistants who um, do their thing for that, right? My rehab business is a little bit more demanding, but I'm still able to have my freedom because the way I set it up. The freedom comes in your systems or in your processes. That's where the freedom comes. The real estate, to be real with you, you're gonna be running around trying to get things done, especially when you first get started out. But once you get your system and processes, that's when the true freedom part comes in. So now you got the financial taken care of and the freedom. Some people only achieve the financial and not the freedom, which you don't want. You want to have the life where you can go talk to your family, friends, kids, hang out with your wife, date your wife, if that what you choose to do, guys. But this is a message coming from the Duru. I just wanted to give you guys the real side of it, man. Please click that video next to me, man. And I'm Nasa, AKA the real estate guru. I'm not a guru, I'm a guru because I actually do this business. And please comment below.